Come on, third graders. If we're going to ever get matched, you've got to get here early. <laughs> We'll learn together. You want to go in an X motion. It's hard to get that left hand to work, isn't it? Try to get it up at least head height. Gives you a little more time to catch it. Okay. Now I want you to take your third score and take two in one hand and try to see if you can do it with three. And you catch it like a cat scratches, like a paw, a cat's paw. Oh, look at Brian. He's, he had it going. Oh, Patrick's got it going. See, even football pe play, players can juggle. Oh, my track athletes can do it too. It, as soon as it reaches its height. Come back and I catch the other one. This class is very skilled. Make sure you get the score high over here, like throw it at least head high. Get it high so you can catch it. Alright, now I'm gonna take your third score and I want you to take two in one hand and you're gonna try to see if you can do it with three. Throw it at your head height. We've got our old pro back here. He's not having any trouble. It just takes time. It takes repetition. It's like riding a bike. We're going to practice that every day till we get them all. Let's see you try that. So just try and demonstrate the last part. Ah, he beat it out, he but he almost got it. But everybody understand? How you're going to take your feet out and try to land just like that. That's what you're going to do right there. And you, you, your turn does not stop until you mess up. So if you do it ankles, then knees then buttocks, then waist, till you mess up. Okay, so everybody get in the same position, and we're going to, uh, the people who are up to our ankles, help me count, uh, spell out diamonds. All right, go. D, I, A, N, D, I, 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 N,
she got well she got it. One foot got it at least. Only got on one. Good try. Brian got it. <laughs> okay, maybe try that again. Maybe raise it a little higher if you can do it. Challenge yourself. Okay. We're going to get through the whole routine today, hopefully. I think they're so advanced they can probably do it with the beat. You know, we're not really little kids. Um, so we can have the beaters so, beating. Since you already know how to beat, your beaters can go ahead and beat while you're, um, and it just, you're going to do it three times back and forth and then you're going to switch. And after you get this done, the next time you all will switch without her telling to you to. So when she starts on the next group, you do it three times, then you go and try to swap with your beater without losing the beat. 
right. You need a lead group, so that lead, whatever this group is doing, that's what everybody else is doing, All right? So make make a lead group, okay. and then then that those beaters start following, and then everybody will follow them. And it's okay for you to count it out and say, okay, ready, switch. I mean, you can talk through the whole thing, okay? the teacher say four three two one then everybody goes on the one right either that or if you have a team captain the team captain can do it then that way you keep the group together you're doing fine y'all are doing fine let's try again I don't, they don't need to practice that. What they can do is you can do what you just did and just say we're going to, when we finish our three, instead of swapping with our partners, we're going to circle the pole three times. Right? So just add the skill on. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay. That way they won't be bored. Y'all are, y'all are, if you were children, I would do exactly what she wanted you to do. She had the right thought process. It's just y'all are not really children, so we need to skip a few steps. Okay. So they go back to their home base? Yes. Is that what you're... We're going to end up back at home and then go switch. 
So are we doing the you're doing the cross first and then the circles, or are we doing the circles and then the? I think she said just circles. Just circles. Circle. Okay. 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 Can we keep it? Oh yeah, sure. I paid, I paid my due, I paid When you switch, you don't lose the beat, folks. You keep beating. You have to get down there with your beater so you can swap without losing it.
group is going to get back to their home base. They're going to go to the next post, and when they start, then the next group can start. Y'all get back to your home base, and then when they start, the next group can start. Don't, don't two transition too fast. Yeah, just two at a time. Okay. And you're going to go all the way through, and then you're just going to get back home. What are the Run over real quick on the next meeting and start later. Are, are the, is there uh, three or four counts between each one? How many counts do they have to get to get the next one? Uh, do four counts. So you'll have four counts in between each time. Each, when they finish, you have four counts to get to the next station. Okay, so two people up. Have your group ready. Okay, ready? Go. Switch teachers, Brian's up. All right, everybody. Kristen, come take his place. If everybody get on this court and run around the circle until I blow the whistle. I only been the time not blow the whistle. Uh, but you're still on to Ninkling, dear. We just don't get a different group. Oh, okay. Very good. I only been the time not blow the whistle. Transitions. I see. He's practicing his transition. Joy, widen, widen. Uh, he's got pretty big shoes to fill. All right, now, we're going to do it again, but this time, we're going to hold your partner's hand. So you got to hold your partner's hand. So if one person is off, then the whole group is going to be screwed. So you got to you gotta do a, a great job of having a rhythm so each one can go at the same time. Start on me, okay? Like we're gonna be going, and I'm saying ready, set, go. Right, here we go. Okay.
was like, start on me, Catherine. Uh, start. <laughs> All right, guys. What we're gonna do this time? Everybody is gonna. We, everybody's gonna do the beat. When I say go, everybody start your step. I want to see everybody going at the exact same time. Yeah. All right, start the beat. We're not gonna hold that. Grade level would this be appropriate? <laughs> what, what, yeah, but why would it be appropriate for only fifth and above? Uh, fifth. <laughs> they, <laughs> because you have to be extremely coordinated to go backwards. Can't you see little kids falling down, going backwards? So you, high school, obviously they can do it, but after they have a, a good skill level, okay? Yeah, this is kind of dangerous because they can't always see backwards. Look at your feet, folks. Look at your feet. <laughs> All right, now, so what I demonstrated, give me the beat. 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 Now 
that's why I don't like going backwards. But you can, I can see us. This, this makes me nervous. This is what we're gonna do. Instead of going backwards, when you go, turn around. Oh, that, that works. That works. I like that. Good modification. Good modification. Now, hold on. What you got to do, it should look as if we're in a straight line. So you all should go the same way and come back the exact same way. This line as well as that. Oh. Start at the same time. Yeah. All right, now, when, when the beat start, when I say go, everybody move at the exact same time. Ready? Start the beat. Studies, quick studies. got to put it all together. All right, now, let's get the beat. Are you get, Are we gonna switch to the second group without stopping? Y'all wanna try? We can try. What we're gonna do? You're gonna go over, go back, and then you're gonna on that the beat that you gotta wait. Swap right there. And, and you're probably going to need at least a four count for them to swap, maybe more. So I don't think the second group should move until they hear you say go. I mean, like, start. Oh, okay. Yeah, you could do it that way. That would work fine, too. Thank you. 
It's time for us to move to the scarves, to the next thing. All right, everybody grab a scarf. And I will time you. We'll see who can go for 30 seconds without messing up. Go ahead and start practicing until I can, I'll pull up my uh, stopwatch. Or just say right left. Like when I was practicing, you can do it more of like this. Right. Whoa, hold on, it's just a second. Right, left, left, right. You see what I'm saying? Count it off. Right, left, left, right. And on the left, come down. Let's see everybody try. Here we go. Two scars. One, two, ready to go. Right, left, left, right. Good. Good. Let's try it again. Right, left, left, right. Easy. Now, let's get another scarf. All right. If you're a right-handed, you'll be best to put the two scars in your left hand. So the opposite scarf, just throw it up in the air and still do the same thing. Right, left, left, right. One, two, ready to go. Right. Good. Oh yeah, we got it, we got it. Good job. All right now, everybody's gonna start at the same time and we're gonna see who can go the longest. Okay, hang on, let me get my, ready? Ready, set, go. One second, two second, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, stop. Let's start again. Um, try to beat your one that you just did. All right, now, this is what we're going to do. Everybody, face a man, face a person, and you're going to compete against that partner. Oh, that's good. That's, that'll work. Challenge yourself. Yeah, challenge Oh, boy. She gets the ringer. All right, when I tell you go, everybody go. Ready? Go. Good job. Yeah. When you have a winner, just start again. Very good. Okay, direct them on who you want to pick up what equipment. Put it back in the closet. Okay. Everybody be in group of two. Everybody run around. I'll go to group. Everybody get a dance. I'm out of group. Ready? Go. One person put your hand on your head. Keep your hand on your head. We're going to pick up the... Poles. And the other people get the scar from your partner, and we're going to put them in the bag. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 